least, come on, I got, I got five kids. He at least got to make at least like two hundred. You want this? <laughs> Seven. Do you really have seven children? Five. I keep. I don't know why I keep saying seven. I'm sorry. Five. How'd you go? You don't know how many kids you get? Seven. Why'd you say seven? Because I've been having the number seven in my head for a while. Don't worry about that. It's been in my head. I've been saying seven all day. Hopefully, I'm gonna be lucky. I'm gonna be lucky. So listen, you're not trolling and you're being honest, correct? You wanna see? Kids, come here, everybody. Get out the refrigerator. <laughs> get out the free. It's not a refrigerator. It's got the refrigerator. No, because they. I'm sorry, Kendra. I was trying to keep them in the back, but they be doing too much. Go in the back for real. You know it's school tomorrow. I'm on the phone. I'm on the phone for real. Go to the back. So for those of y'all that don't know, this show is like a matchmaking show where uh, single women call in to try and get a match. And let's see what this one is about. <laughs> I got five kids, but I've been thinking about the number seven, but I think I'm lucky. Okay. Okay. Okay, Sarah, thank you for getting your kids to prove it. So how old are your five children? Okay. Eleven. I got two seven years old. I'm smacking your lips, and two three year olds. They look wait, wait, so I'm three not a hoe. I got pregnant three times. How many so men? What? How many men? How many you think? Don't don't try to gag me either. Well, because excuse me, because you're taking a long time to answer. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna assume. Three. I'm gonna I'm gonna assume three. Yeah, they all have their own fathers. Yeah. So why are you not with the twins, the three year old? I was I was up here, and he heard my feelings. And, he, and if I had the house in Atlanta, he kicked me out. So now I'm here in the projects, but I'm happy. He kicked me out, so I'm single now. Remember how long you been single? How long you been single for? About three weeks. He kicked me out soon as he saw the video. Look, like you saw me before and you wasn't video. single? No. What? I got all my boxes. Oh, Sarah, I I remember you. Wait, are you married? I used to be before he found out about the video and me wanting another man. So he put me out. I just came back to the projects. Sierra Alessa, 34. She has five kids. A set of twins that are three. Wait, wait, wait. What? So she was married <clears throat> and she called in into a matchmaking show looking for a man while she was already married. Uh. A set of twins that are seven and 11 year old, all by different men. The three year old twins, you currently live with them in the house. I live in the house. We live in the house. House. See, I, I, have, I have a very serious question. What kind of man you think is going to date you that knows that you still live with your baby daddy who you have three-year-old twins by? Wait seven seconds. Can I be honest? They just do it all the time. Why? They, what, what's the difference with me? They do it all the time. I swear to God. I bet you a hundred... I bet you a good 50% of your women that slept with men in cars because they nigga live with a, a chick. You know, if my if my husband today say he finds any woman that uses the n word that much, nigga this, nigga that, nigga, it's a no, it's a no, it's a no. Another girl. Your husband? I, your your husband? I, I, I live husband? with him, but we not together. You know, people live together. Whoa, pause! I thought he was just your child's father. You're you're literally married. Because mm -hmm. I couldn't remember you, but now I do remember you. But you, but okay, because, okay, are you the one that said you live with your child's father? You, when I was in Atlanta, remember? But you also told me that you, when you was married, so you got divorced in three weeks? Uh, no, my sis, his mother, they Africans, and they was mad. They was like, you should never marry that American girl. She was ghetto. And I was like, who are they? 
Because I come, I, listen, I came with my kids. I say, Kia, my kids, who are you to tell a nigga what, who he should be with? So he, he sided with them. So here I... <clears throat> if you're listening to me, if you're watching me right now, right? You're a black American woman. Know this. Take this as a friendly advice. Men, like myself, from African backgrounds, have African parents. Very, very traditional. Very, very conservative. Like, really, really conservative. A lot of them do not want their kids getting married to black American women. That's the... F I'm just... I'm being honest. They do not welcome the idea. Because they believe black Americans do not have a culture. Wayward, ghetto, dog, whatever bad connotations you could put in there. They do not want that. They say they are uncultured. Just know that if, you, if you're dating a, an African person, you want to get married into the family. You have to have some moral decorum about you. You can't be walking around with too much tattoos, using N-word this, N-word that. That won't fly in an African family. Take it or leave it. I am. I'm in the projects, but I'm good. I got my food stamps, my welfare, my SSD. My, look, I'm good. I don't need no nigga for real, but I just want one. I want a man that has no kids. He can't have no kids. <sighs> okay. She got her. Yeah, but you. So she's got kids, five kids from f three different men, and she's demanding whatever man is going to come to her life to not have kids of his own, because that would be too much baggage for her. Just told me you have five kids. <laughs> Where's Kevin Samuels when you need him? You can't make this shit up, man. Is it now you don't want a man with no kids? Why would I already have my own baggage? So I wait, because I have kids. I gotta want him because I got kids. So okay. you want a man to accept you and your five kids and it he can't have it? So basically, you wouldn't date yourself? No. I want a real dude that's gonna ride with me and my kids. That let me tell you, half of the people up here ain't got no father, don't even know them. So at the end of the day, this might not be no different for him. Most niggas don't got no father. And um, does he have to make a certain amount of money? All well, these ghetto New York chicks from the Bronx or from wherever, Bronx River, uh, just, just stay away, man. Nothing good can come out of this. Come on, I got, I got five kids. He at least got to make at least like 200. And you want this? <laughs> grand a year 200k a year your delusion is beyond the pale like there is no way a man earning even 100k is looking at your direction Nigga, a man earning 50,000 is not looking at your direction you've got four, five kids with three that man you got married to that you fucked the whole thing up that was your final bust up that was that was it that was it. You're done right now. 